Good morning. You can't blame TikTok for removing accounts. You have to put the blame where the blame belongs. The blame is on the haters. The blame is on the ones who really don't have any talent. They only can put their picture beside another creator or steal another creator's work or, you know, try to discredit that creator and pick them apart and because they really don't care about the feelings of families or victims. Theirs is all about ratings, but they, they hide behind the, the mask of caring, the mask of saying how terrible people like oh, Rajo Productions is for telling the cold, hard, ugly truth. But we want the truth. I want the truth. Don't you want the truth? You really want somebody executed because you all think they're in a theater? I think it's more insulting to be betting on what kind of a tie Brian Kohlberger is going to wear into court versus what really happened to these young people. Um, let's hit on the fight. The fight that Santa was in, that they were all watching at the food truck, that they were all betting on. You think no one was going to rob her of that fight money? Hmm, there's motive. Oh, what about Maddie dumping all that product that belonged to Santa's mother? What was the street value on that? Like two million? And that fight would have taken care of everything and Santa was pregnant. Well, what kind of desperate situation were these kids in? Fighting for their lives. But nobody nobody wants to talk about that, right? Ban the account, get rid of them, call them sick. Well, if it's sick to want the truth, then I don't want to be well. If it's sick to want the right person to pay for this, well, I don't want to be well. Let's view what we really think about sick. 